back again with another street beef TikTok beef fight. We're gonna break these bad boys down. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. If you like what you saw, like the video. Also, hit the notification bell to know when we do drop another video or when we go live playing games. All right, boys, here we go. Another street beef. Let's see what we got. Oh, Lord. Glove up or shut up? 155. Mm. Height. One, um, <laughs> height 6'3. <laughs> and the reason for that, he's talked about my family, and I don't pull it up with that. Okay. Right, there ain't no show, Chris. 6'3, 210. And he wanted to fight, so we fight. Street uh, beef. Right. I respect it. We got us a little TikTok beef. <laughs> TikTok. I don't know a lot about it. I don't either. My son runs our TikTok channel. I, I don't. I don't but do TikTok. These two somehow managed to beef on TikTok. Mm. <laughs> so we're gonna let him solve it. <laughs> One more time. Your fight name? Finro. Finro. He's got a cup. And Hold it steel. And no show Chris. <laughs> Finro versus no show Chris for all the TikToks. Buddy show. Be safe, fellas. Fight on. Hey, man, you guys want to touch them up or y'all beefing or can you get good? You oh, God. I wish I would have got the age of the other guy on the right. Let's go. Bang time. Bang time. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. So I got, uh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> well, well, uh, 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 first off, uh, first off, A for commitment for our gentleman to the right, the 6'3 guy who weighs 155 pounds. Watch, he gets, he wastes no time, boys. <laughs> he crosses distance very slow, like a panther coming up on a poor little penguin, okay? Okay. Creep it. <laughs> he initiates his attack with uh, Hisapa with a cross. <laughs> and then the penguin gets caught with a right hook. <laughs> he lands a couple of I fucking can't even break it out, boys. Look at him. What is he thinking? What is he thinking, right? Oh, man. He lands about four shots. Oh. <laughs> then the pig responds, gets knocked back into reality. He goes, oh, shit, I am fighting. And then the panther jumps out of there. All right, let's get it. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Oh, man. So, come on. You're still in there. You're still in there, baby. Okay, I liked how the ref stopped it. As he turned his back, obviously, he didn't want any more of it. Turned his back, he didn't want, and the ref stopped it, and he's giving him an eight count, so a nine or ten count. I'm not sure, but he didn't get dropped. So, I think uh, the other gentleman, the penguin, uh, realized the Panther doesn't hit that hard. So now he's just going to fucking bum rush him the whole entire time. Let's go. Hey, let's go. Hey. Let's go. Oi. Okay. The Penguins, uh, the, the Panther's reaching. He's reaching now. Ooh, good body shot. That wasn't liver. That wasn't liver. That's your solar plex. Okay. This guy is always leading with the, the lead hook. It's always lead hook, lead hook, lead hook. That's what he's trying to land on him. Every single time. Keep your hands up, buddy. Oh, Ooh, that was a body shot. That was a good body shot. Is she on the phone? She's on the phone. He's back up. He's back up, boys. Oh! 
Shut up. Dan, let him do his thing. You distracted him. And me. Oh, hey. I got a Hall of Fame. Cerulea, Jive, Joker. Let's check out this Hall of Fame, boys. Hey, right, here we go. Keep going. Oh, man. He's got way too many body shots on him, boys. Come on, let's get it. Boy, nice little three punch combination. You're gonna stop it. Yeah, you stop it. Hey. So, real quick, he said you talked about his family. Uh-oh. Really family We're going to find out. We're going to get to the bottom of this bullshit. We're going to get to the bottom of it, boys. We're going to find out right now. What's going on? That's the one thing I had a reason why I came in. But can we, let me ask you this. Yeah. You understand why he'd be upset about that? I told him after that, who'd know? Y'all done? Yeah. No yeah. more bullshit. Both of y'all showed up. You, I just saw the beef. You didn't knock me out, but you did yeah. good. Good yeah. fight, yeah. guys. Saw beef. Good job, you know that's that's a good thing. I I, I will say this. You know, I, in the in the in the chats, you know, I watch King in the Streets and I also watch Street Beefs, right? Two different promotions, right? Two different styles of fighting. Where King in the Streets, they are King in the Streets. There is no gloves. They are fighting on concrete. It is it is savage. It, it is. Whew. Where this one, it seems like, hey, you're talking about my mom. I want to I want to settle this. I don't I don't appreciate you talking about my mom. So we're gonna fight. Nowadays, in today's society, if you have any confrontation with somebody outside in the streets, nine out of ten times, they're either going to have a gun or they're going to have a knife, right? So I respect the fact that these guys, they had, a, they had a, a disagreement. They stepped in the cage. They fought. One guy won. One guy lost. Hey, everything's bygones be bygones. Let's go our own separate ways. And they're done with it. But this one was absolutely hilarious. You know, homeboy came across the cage immediately, immediately, and took it to him, right? <laughs> to, to be honest with you, this gentleman's technique is perfect. Look where he's at. He's behind the shoulder, behind the foot. That lead cross is an amazing. This is pinned perfect. The only thing this gentleman lacks is power. Is power. But... Where he is at right now, that is great technique, right? You want to be behind him, behind that shoulder, because if this guy wanted to return fire, he is not going to hit nothing. He is he's in a bad position, okay? So the fact that he is behind the shoulder, landing that cross across his face, that is that is damn good technique. Don't, don't, don't let it fool you, boys and ladies. Don't let it fool you. That is good technique right there. Just this part right here, this part. And then when he does there, he just fucks himself. He just fucks it up. But, ladies and gentlemen, that was Street Beef's TikTok beef. I enjoyed this one. This was hilarious. If you guys did not laugh while watching this fight, then that's your bad. But I had a good time breaking this one down. Like, subscribe, hit the bell so no one we drop another one, boys. We out. Mmm.